Ninjas in Pajamas. seconds here and luminosity they should not be giving up this round there's almost no way that forest can do this he's got the clock out though hasn't reloaded yet and looking for more headshots and they're a little bit scared of him forest is actually controlling right now where the luminosity players can move and where they can't 30 seconds gonna go for the peak once again it's a one versus one fight and right now forest he's just he's just dueling them one at a time he gets a headshot and fallen he might actually do this call this behind him for oh my god he picks it up that's gonna be the win and i what a way to start! Perfect angle and he gets it. That's going to slow things down, but no, they don't. They keep running into him and there we go. This is surely going to be his triple. He does get it. Nothing goes down. And Forrest just coming into his own here. Perfect play with the orb. Sean Garris last man. Still, still, if they start getting the rounds now, there's still a little bit of a glimmer of hope, but Fnatic don't look challenged yet. It's 7-0. That's a beginning though. Forrest going to find JW. And now this three-man stack that was heading towards B might have to consider his options here. From long. Maybe looking for some control on this map. Forest, well and truly aware. Oh, connects another. That's Crims down. Goes back in. He knows there's one more here. He knows there's another player towards mid. Nice little pop flash. Does catch Pronax as well. Look, look at Olaf. Look at Flusher. They're still eyeing up B. Pronax is working through that smoke. And Get Right is looking to work his way through as well. They're just centimeters apart. Get Right's lurking in the depths. It doesn't matter. Forest catches him. That's three already. And oh, the double to finish it off. Olaf and Flusher go down. Gets the a better shot at cracking this site, but this is going to be the A push here. Out of LDLC, they decide to just run straight up short, but Forrest assassinating them left and right, landing headshot after headshot, and it's going to be a third one. Forrest gets the fourth as well, and there you have it, NIP. He might be able to fireball Michael Lillis' position with it, which would be a great start for LDLC. Charging in as Michael Lillis tries to get away, but Forrest is coming up from behind. USPS in hand, then executes shots. Next in line, Smith goes down, Forrest. He's looking for more, he's charging on, he's unreal! He takes down MBK as one of this happy in Kyushima. He turns 180, takes the fight, he's got one. Evenly, and I think that's not good enough. I think he had to get a couple of kills, or he had to stay alive, but he couldn't really hide after that first one. Forrest, Wild Flash, gonna take down Sipnix, what a big kill. And he's got the C set out, goes for more, takes Dupree, he's ready with the AWP, he scopes through, he knifes him, oh my god! Takes down Device, he's gonna get gutted and Carriger will be alone, 1v3 here, takes the one kill, but this is a oh, disaster, Forrest with a quad kill in the round. And one <laughs> Just does that nine. smoke balloon. and caught a glimpse of him, now Forrest is gonna be aware that someone's probably pushed through, Blade did just have a spin around, but we'll get caught out here, Forrest just tracking him, waiting for him to turn. Is that enough time? Is that enough time? Oh, don't do it, buddy. Just go for the weapon. Make it easy, yep. Make it easy for yourself. Caught a glimpse, got the information. Well done, Forrest. Gets in, gets out. Now he knows World Edit is possibly there as well. Switches to the AK, gets the headshot on him as well. Forrest playing this absolutely beautiful Counter-Strike here. Now Shara's picked off Pit. That's over the side, but Forrest gets himself his fourth. And the damage very much done there. Considering he thought about the knife for one moment, he played it brilliantly. But Shara's not done yet. He's got himself two. Could make it a third as well. We could be on for a cracker. And there's Ace for Forrest. Brilliantly done. Just dominating the restrooms, which is something I wouldn't want to say about Forrest. CZ. <laughs> yeah. Because Doja had one smoke, but he's on a P2K still. So that is very interesting here. And Simple has C-Set and Kit. Yeah, so exactly. Happened. 
Kucha with the opening kill and simple following up, looking good for Hellraisers. But Makalov will go down in IP, charging through, and the headshot on Kucha is going to send him cowering back into the construction area. Forrest will take a kill as well and goes for a little bit more. NIP powering through, he steals that pistol. Seven bullets and Forrest, that's now a triple kill. He's on seven health, the bomb is down as well. Exists in the background, getting caught by Doja here and it's a 2-1-2. Hellraisers, they need to clear out these NIP members but they cannot. Forrest now at a quad kill. He fakes it once Doja but Forrest is looking for the ace and he picks it up. He decimates the Hellraisers lineup. 2 v 3 oh and there it is. Yeah, right, last man standing device, that draw speed, he's, go he's gonna go down. If that had been the old C set, it would have been no issue at all. Get right, trying to AWP. Yeah, 1v2, running up here with P250 out, jumping and shooting, he gets one more kill. Looking for it, he's got him hunted down, time is up, oh my god! Get right, you're gonna be kidding me, he gets the last kill in one second left! Meanwhile, Pit has fallen, 2v4. We've seen an IP clutch rounds from these kind of situations before, but they've been smoked off. This makes it that much harder. Forrest charges through. He is going to find himself on the receiving end of a battering. Here comes Get Right. He gets life but peeks around and destroys Twist. And now this clutch is doable. Get Right. Surely Godsent haven't just let this round slip away. He's been dinked, but the time is down. And Get Right is going to clutch the round. He can see what he's doing. should know he's here. Wait for that aim punch to kick in, unless Get Right does the unthinkable. That's the first step. Two more to go. Sees the Molly. Oh, get right! Find Scream. It's a 1v1. He sprays in. Bodies above him. And get right playing. Gutsy CS. Now it's down to time. 19 seconds. Body has the bomb. And get right has the angle. He sprays it wildly and he gets it. Get right with an insane 3k. That is the get right that you know and love and have waited we'll to see. It up towards Freiburg's location for a second time running. <gasps> get right's going to pop dog already. Oh, do he's, it. Do it. He's going to go behind him. As soon as he hears that. Oh, look at this. This could be absolutely oh fatal. It's gonna come around. It's just gonna be a mow down from Get Right. Oh he gets all God. four. Not quite the fifth at the end. Now the kill here on IP because Bomb's not in position, and this is letting Get Right exist to get a lot closer. But thankfully, kills come the other way. It's just Get Right remaining. He's got two kills out of this. A third as well. Bomb does drop. It's a problem now entirely. But Pauf does have the AK. And get Right still limited to the CZ 75 head shown. Pauf can't find the immediate shot. That's going to give Get Right a bit of information. Goes back out. It's on 22 HP. Get Right can do this. Three kills already. Bomb in an awkward position. Pauf has to jump up, but Get there Right's got it. CZ 75, four kills, and Pronax makes the mistake of not playing immediately. That's anything to go by. He'll be there, and he's going to be under threat right away. He's already up on the choke point. Freiburg gonna fall back and he's gotta be so careful. Flash goes out, but they're already pushing on to get right. Two for him, huge play, and that Flash catches them all. What a start! Already a four kill right now for Christopher. Flash dead onto Freiburg, and guess what? Two guys are looking straight at him, but get right is here. And oh. get right with the triple, the quad! That is it! Get out of his sight! this position. Sure, if they boost up like he's expecting, but if they get into the bomb side and they are walking in right now, he's looking for the shot here. You can see a couple of faces. Well, there's the one kill. That's a good start here, but they're challenging him. They're fighting him. They're not scared. Get right. Oh, he gets all three kills. Looking for one to go. SCH, get right. Shutting it down. And it's 14 to 7. Caller for Navi, typically. You know, is he actually doing that for on the server now? Let's see. Get right. Not interested in having any mercy whatsoever. <laughs> he's just going to leave Starks alone. They just need two kills here, and they will win it. For the second time, Pronex with one Freiburg. Oh my god! He's freezed and he gets both kills! And the grand final continues! 15 to 13! Oh my god, I'm at a loss for words right now. These NIP retakes, they're giving me a heart attack. This is some of the most crazy Counter-Strike I've ever seen out of NIP. Just constantly retaking these bomb sites in almost impossible situations. I'm going to ask you a question after this round, but now we're sure. going to waiting here. Forrest looking for the kill, doesn't get it here. That would have been an instant death. Geraint realizing someone's behind him. He's going to go down, though. Hiko with a really important backstab here. It's not over yet. Nothing will pick up one more, and I don't think NIP can actually seal this round. It looked so good. Just a few seconds left here. Seven, six left. Freiburg goes for the kill. He's going to pick it up. If just exists, he's going to win the round. There's no time. Oh, my God, Freiburg, are you kidding me? They win the round because... So, Fnatic, they shouldn't be getting more than a couple of kills here at the most. They're actually Freiburg, look at a spray here. Quad kill, all headshots, all from us. That was very impressive and good control. It's almost out of this round. Cure me device low. And Freiburg might be offered up a frag here. He's sandwiched between two players. Two kills come down for Freiburg. And he's holding his position. Third kill. Beautiful work from Freiburg. Is he going to get any more out of this round? 
He's done more than the first team, but he's gonna get a fourth. A fourth frag, all headshots. Unbelievable! Bialy's gonna be able to go in for the backstab. And Bialy already checking that angle. So this is pretty much it. There's no backing up now for Freiburg. He needs to make some kind of play and he's actually just gonna go for the straight defuse. Three seconds, two seconds. He's actually gonna pull this off! Freiburg! The one play that he could actually make in that situation. Going for the rotation through middle. And they're gonna try and hold this off from Connector. It is planted in a slightly open but position where it's able to be diffused behind that box, it's going to be problematic, especially where they're on it already. Pauk may find one, but they can't find the shot. Freiburg's still holding. They can't get it, and Freiburg's got it. Holds his nerve once again. It's Freiburg clutching on the TR. He's made there, thrown by Nip to try and hold them back. Old Freiburg will find the shot on. Exist. Freiburg does return, picks off Phonax. He's still here, though, and he's going for more. Two big frags. The third man is here, however, and Freiburg has to back off. But Freiburg somehow opens it up single-handedly. All three frags, but the bomb is on the other side. Yeah, but that could be all right. Fnatic are making a huge rotation. Freiburg, all he has to do is stay alive, and it's going to be great. Oh, he picks up a quad kill. He could do even better than staying alive. He gets the kill now. That ace, and that would be absolutely brutal. Fnatic, that could really work. Then Freiburg comes in. He's crazy. Freiburg misses, and it's the ace. He picks it up single-handedly. Prince Fnatic, what a play! They'll still be able to afford whatever for the last round, and this is going to be really crucial now what happens here on Catwalk. Oh, there's Freiburg. Freiburg! Both kills! Adrian comes in, and Freiburg with three! This is it! He gets the spray! Freiburg, they finally shut him down, but it's a one on three! Fantastic play! The entry fragger at his best! And Forrest does it! Nip go to the finals! Navi! What now? Look at all this information. Oh, oh my god. god, this is so sick from Fur. Oh my god. Exist! What was that? Just gets the idea, and now FNX tries to get that information back, get the play back into their favor. Bring it back down to a 4v4, extending on long, but now here comes that Glock train. And well, it's been met by some severe force and cold. Zera fallen, just joining forces and taking them down as they try and set one by one through towards shot. But get right, forging the pass through mid. Doesn't quite get much done, leaving just Exist alive in a 1v3. Exist as well, not even really having a good amount of intel as to where exactly should play these final two players against. Doesn't spot the one below him, the jump comes in, gets some good trade damage back in, but he himself is being pelted down pretty quickly, trading things out for a Glock, but 27 HP. Exist doesn't have a whole lot left to work with, and also constantly watching out for that flank here now. FNX, he's gonna strike soon, he's out. 12 HP left on Exist now, but the triple shot shuts it down. Exist might be able to make that Maybe could have got to be just on the edge, but this could be smart, or it could be over. Cold Zero is going to get the peak now. They know his position. 39 seconds. He has 12 HP. This is so little to work with. How's he going to try and play this one around now? Trying to isolate maybe one of the, bring it to a 1v1 if he could, but... Okay. Okay. This... I think Portman's going to hear steps here, but yeah, here we go. He's going to get a plan out of this. This is incredibly intelligent from Exist, making what is a pretty bad situation actually work for him here. He can plan pretty safely. They're going to go for that short retake, so as long as he keeps his head down, he's got a chance in this one now. Now trying to hold back, however, as the both of the remaining members of LG are going to try to go for a retake back over through Cat. He's smoking off. He's in the corner, though. He's got to line up these oh headshots. There's one of them. Make it look like this is going to be a B execute it's with that Molotov be behind uh, behind behind the barrels, but it's not going to be enough. Look at this, already rotating off, but that doesn't change the fact that Alu gets the entry frag on JW. Key frag right there, and they're going to be able to get the bomb plant. And now it gets very difficult. Go. What was that exist? The spray transfer, double headshot for him. He's going to make a double force as well, and he's in good position to get the third. No, exist comes around the wow. What a reaction shot! How does he turn that quickly? Shocks goes down, one and on it's one. into a one-on-one. -on -one. Advantage firmly going the way of Keo in terms of HP. And he's already in position to go for the retake, but exists. No, exists. Exists. And oh my goodness! That's you big. talk about a clutch, and now it's a four-round spread, and NIP are in firm control. The kill flush have very nearly gone down, but he's still staying alive. By time, Freiburg has no patience. Gets him through the box as well. Exists looking for the jump shot. He's going to jump off the lid and take down JW. Oh, oh, oh my God! Oh, 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 oh
my god, it's just what are you doing? Takes down three members in three seconds. And 45 seconds left. I think Fnatic are just on the brink of it. And there it is, a double peek into middle. Flusher will get the opening assist. Let's one by goes for the kill, gets a double. One more kill, it's a triple kill. And Pronax goes down, it's all up to all of my stuff. And Ixis wants the quad get right, will take I might it. I struggling to get out of middle at the moment and see some position. Just able to spray down with the last bit onto Flamey flame there. But there is some more players. Oh wow, that was a, such a nice shot there by Exist. He gets a triple. He has been playing super well recently. And now it's going to be a 2 on 3 here. Thanks to the individual skill, but it's going to be the... the NAP is trying to wait here, so they will force a rotation for the A side. We do get the kills on the trade, so... to get some damage done. Uh, this is very dangerous now. NIP are running out of players. Just two left. This, this round is very strong here from TSM Device. Over the top. Oh, gets the frag with the M4, but he's diffusing. He's holding the defuse. Oh, How did they let that happen? Why did it peak? <laughs> he was on top of him. He must have heard the defuse sound. Oh why Why wouldn't he go after he got the first one? Why wouldn't he just go one step ahead and look down? Actually, because, uh, you know, I get right was holding the angle with the AWP, so... They have the ability to move there, and that's going to tell them a lot. But there's three players here, and all the spray coming into play. Exist gets triple. Excellent stuff from him. That AK spray down is going to give them that A bomb site. Oh, he's going to get one more as well. And now NIP, they completely destroyed all the dreams and hopes of Na'Vi in this round. Get a hot cloth on the fevered head like a needle. They'll lead them and they'll follow like thread. But where could Exist come back in from behind? He's going to try and isolate this into a one-on-one -on -one right now. And it is not going to work out in his favor. No, I take it back. He does get to free. But in the meantime, he did lose his teammate. Now it's just him that's alive. He's going to stay on top of the train, not love him, come up with the ladder. And it's going to be just the 12 HP to work with. He has got the butterfly knife, but he has to fly like a butterfly and sting like a bee. He's got the first one already on the Kerrigan. Has to fall away further still in the E-Box. It's low on device. He's got this down one-on-one. -on -one. He actually works it out. The clutch from Exist. I love it. I don't know who I'm impressed with more exists than that massive clutch of the knife round. Are you actually carrying uh, it? Uh, hopefully in time for ESWC as well to bring you, to make the production value a lot higher as uh, Team X is pushing. <laughs> oh, jeez. What is going on? This guy is a maniac. Jesus Christ. Oh, wow. There's the ace from Exist. Team G2 just waiting for the rotation to come in, and indeed, their positioning has paid off. Body getting taken down, but again, it's Pit, the last man standing here. Jumping P250, can't expect much to be done. Ooh, if he can get a second kill, that's the bomb as well. And now he's got position here. Need to get himself the knife, have to pit. Are you serious? What is that? How? Pit's gone like man, that was a fantastic play. The ace out of nowhere in the Kevlar. This guy, that's what, that's what NIP needed. Yeah, yeah 100 plus. Nice. Nice. Cider banana. Oh, 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 oh my god. They thought they had it. They were like, you know what? We got this. Let's play like idiots. Uh, I'll pop. I'll get that. Sandwich, I think. Sandwich, one. Nice. It's a one on three situation, good process for you. Oh, swift it off. Aim keep. We One more. Under you. I am planning to bomb. I am 
Blessing to bomb. Yes, sir. Das ist